If you want to break into data analytics, this is my 10 week plan to do so. In week one, you're going to explore what data careers are available, like data engineer, data scientist, data analyst, BI engineer, etc. You're going to focus on data cleaning and how to have an analytical mindset. In week two, you're going to revamp your LinkedIn because LinkedIn is where hiring happens. So you want to make sure you have a good LinkedIn as soon as you possibly can. You're going to focus on data analysis in Excel because that's a great place to start since you probably already have some Excel experience. And you're going to build a project in Excel. So if you don't know what a project is, you don't know what a portfolio is, you're going to learn about that in week two. In week three, you're going to cover data visualization 101. This is how to make charts like bar charts, scatter plots, pie charts, correlation, stuff like that. Then you're going to go into Tableau. Tableau is a great place to make data visualizations. So you're going to learn all things Tableau. And then of course, redo your resume since you've already revamped your LinkedIn. In week four, you're going to dive into SQL or SQL, which stands for Structured Query Language. It's a great it's probably the most used data tool that there is. You're going to start building your portfolio where you can put your Excel project and your Tableau project and your new SQL project. In week five, you're going to dive back into Excel doing a little bit more advanced stuff. And after week five, you can start job hunting because it's going to take a lot of applications for you to get your first interview. And once you get your first interview, it's going to take you a couple of those to land your first job. In week six, we're going to go back and revisit Tableau, do some more advanced data visualization and dashboard creation. You're also going to be doing interview practice at this time because hopefully by week five, you're going to be landing some interviews and you're also going to be going into data viz 201, going to some more complex charts like stacked bar charts and heat maps. Week seven, I would still be doing those job applications and that would be my main focus. But in the meantime, I'm upscaling in Python. I'm basically learning data visualization and data analysis with Python. Just the basics, we're talking matplotlib and pandas only. Week eight, I'm going to dive into R and statistics. Just make sure I know the basics of like a hypothesis test, what a p-value is, maybe what a NOVA is, and all that can be done really easily in R. I just wanna make sure I can say that I've learned Python and R, even if it's just basic. Week nine, I'm just barely getting to know Power BI, Alteryx, Flourish, BigQuery, SAS. I'm not actually really learning these, but I just know what they are and how they work. And if I needed to learn them more, I could before an interview, kind of cram style. Then week 10, I'm doing a capstone, some sort of project based off of all these things I've learned in the previous weeks and I've continued to apply to jobs. And hopefully one of those interviews is gonna come through and I'll be able to land the job. If you have any questions about this roadmap, put them in the comments down below and I'll do my best to try to answer all of them.